welcome to video number 22. Uh, today we'll be talking about compliments and supplements. I'm Miss uh, Yudira. And I'm Miss Myra. So we'll start with uh, some definitions. So complementary angles are any angles whose uh, measure add up to 90s. So these two angles that are adjacent um, can add up to 90 as well as angles that are not adjacent can also add up to 90. For supplementary angles, um, a pair of angles whose measures add up to 180, so the same here, these angles are adjacent to each other and they equal 180, but they also don't have to be um, adjacent to each other, so for the instance, these angles here um, would also equal to 180. So we'll move on to the next slide. Okay, now that Yadira explained what complementary and supplementary angles, let's try to find a couple pairs. Let's start with... Let's start with finding complementary angles. So what did Yadira say? She said complementary are two angles that add up to 90 degrees. For instance, this 20 degree angle plus this 70 degree angle will be a complementary angle. Why? Because they equal to 90. Let's try to find another one. This 40 degree angle and this 50 degree angle will be a complementary angle to add up to 90. And if you notice, this one's a complementary angle within itself. It's 90 degrees. Now let's try to find two pairs of supplementary angles. As Yadira mentioned, supplementary is equal to 180. For instance, 110 degrees plus 70 would give you a supplementary angle, which add up to 180. And just for extra practice, 140, this angle right here, plus 40 gives you 180. All right, so moving on to the next slide, we have find each angles complement and supplementary if possible. So we have this angle of 27. To, so to find the complement, we would have to do 90 minus 27. And if we put that in our calculators, that would be 63. And then for supplement, we have 180 minus 27. That would be 153. Moving on, um, on to the next example, we have 64. So in order to find the complement, we have 90 minus 64, and then the supplement will be 180 minus 64. So we have 90 minus 64 would be 26, and then 180 minus 64 would be 116. Our third angle here is 130, so our complement would be, actually there is no complement, because uh, Complement, again, it's equals to 90 degrees, and this one is 130, so there wouldn't be a complement here. And then it would be a supplement, because it's 180 minus 130, that would be 50. So remember, complement are angles that equal to 90, and supplement are angles that equal to 180. Moving on. Okay, so we have extra practice here but in a table format. So you have the angle 35 degrees and you're trying to find its complement. Like Yadira mentioned, complement, it'll be 90. It'll be 90 minus 35. It'll, and then for supplement, 180 minus 35. Complement will be, again, 90 minus 71. Supplement 180 minus 71. Once again, complement 90 degrees minus 84 degrees. Supplement 180 minus 84 degrees. Complement, wait, we said complement was 90 degrees. That's over 90 degrees, so there is no complement. Supplement would be 180 minus 126. If you plug those in into your calculator, you should get the complementary angle and the supplement. 
All right, so we have um, word problems here. So what we want to find first is we have the sum of measures of an angle's complement and supplement, to, uh, supplement equals to 230 find an angle. So keep in mind that x is the angle and then we have my 90 minus x would be the complement and then 180 minus x would be the supplement. Okay, knowing this, we can find the sum of the measures of an angle's complement supplement equals 230. So we have 230. And then we have the sum of, so we have the angle's complement, which is 90 minus x, and the sum, so it's plus. And then the supplement would be 180 minus x, and that would equal to 230. So if you solve this, um, you should be able to find the angle. So again, 180 and nine plus 90 would be 270 minus 2x, 230. So you should be able to find the angle after you solve for x. Mm -hmm. Okay, now for the next word problem. The supplement of an angle is 10 times larger than its complement. So what we did for this one was we have the supplement of an angle. This is the supplement of an angle. So 180 minus x equals an angle is 10 times larger than its complement. So it's 10 times larger than what? Its complement. So it's going to be 90 minus x. And then... Once you combine like terms, you should solve for the angle and that's how you'll be able to find your angle, right? Mm -hmm. By solving. So you just distribute here. From there, you can start doing that on your own. And just to double check, we got x equals 80 here. And for this problem, just could you should be sure if your work is correct, x equals 20. All right, so now we have journal assignments. So copy this down to your journal and again, find the complement, the supplement of one, 110. Um, and then follow the examples that we gave in regards to the table below. And also um, try out the word problem. Sum the measures of the angles, complement, supplement, and equals to 140. So that should be all. Good Thank luck, you. Have a good one.